The Russian Su-57 and the United States F-22 are both advanced fifth-generation combat aircraft with impressive specifications. While the F-22 is generally considered more maneuverable and stealthy, holding an edge in air superiority, the Su-57 has been touted as a capable combat aircraft. However, the Su-57 absence from significant air-to-air -air combat in Ukraine has raised questions about its effectiveness, and it is often suggested that the F-22 ranks higher in stealth capabilities than the Su-57. The F-22 Raptor, developed by Lockheed Martin, is a stealth fighter with a top speed of 1,599 miles per hour and a range of 2,000 miles. It has a 20mm internal automatic cannon and can carry a variety of air-to-air -air and air-to-ground missiles. The F-22 is considered more maneuverable and stealthy, with a proven track record of air superiority. The Su-57 developed by Sukhoi has a top speed of 1,616 miles per hour and a range of 3,107 miles. It has a 30mm internal cannon and can carry a variety of weapons including air-to-air -air and air-to-ground missiles. The Su-57 has a larger weapons bay than the F-22, allowing it to carry more weaponry. In terms of maneuverability, the F-22 is considered more agile, which could give it an advantage in a dogfight. However, the Su-57 is designed for a different role and may not be optimized for close-range combat. The F-22 also has better stealth capabilities, with diamond-shaped wings, sharp faceted surfaces, and radar-absorbing materials. The Su-57 has been criticized for its lack of stealth technology, with some experts suggesting that it is no match for the F-22 or F-35 in this regard. The F-22 has been in production since 2005 and has seen limited production due to cost and a shift towards the F-35 Lightning II. The Su-57, while newer, has struggled with development and a production crash. Here are some potential scenarios where these aircraft might be employed. Air superiority. In a scenario where both the F-22 and Su-57 are deployed in an air superiority role, the F-22 would likely have an advantage due to its superior maneuverability and stealth capabilities. The F-22's emphasis on stealth and maneuverability, combined with its advanced avionics and situational awareness, would give it an edge in this type of combat. Long-range engagements. In longer-range engagements, the Su-57 might have an advantage due to its larger weapons bay and ability to carry more weaponry. The Su-57 infrared search and track system, something the F-22 lacks, would also be a significant advantage in these types of engagements. In close-range combat, the F-22 maneuverability and stealth capabilities would be less effective, and the Su-57 overall better maneuverability at most parts could give it an advantage. However, the F-22 superior thrust to weight, vastly superior avionics and much better, more powerful radar would still provide it with a significant edge in this type of combat. Both the F-22 and Su-57 are capable of air-to-ground operations, but the Su-57 larger weapons bay allows it to carry more weaponry, which could give it an advantage in this type of combat. Both the F-22 and Su-57 have electronic warfare capabilities, but the F-22 stealth and superior avionics would make it more difficult for the Su-57 to get a lock on it, giving the F-22 a potential advantage in this area. While both aircraft are impressive, the F-22 proven track record, maneuverability and stealth capabilities give it an edge in a head-to-head -head comparison. However, the Su-57 is a newer aircraft and may have improvements that could potentially change its performance in the future.